what's going on guys that was a short clip of me trying to start the car but today we are going to be installing a quick release and steering wheel on my drift missile that's the missile and that's the race car both shitty but I got this steering wheel from D&D &D Performance you by the way quality stuff nice the NRG hub and their quick release so today we will be installing them all right I guess we'll start by Taking the stock, I mean, not stock, but shitty eBay steering wheel off. Mm, it's missing a bolt. And no, I didn't buy this and put this on. The previous owner of this car did. Uh oh. Once I take these bolts off, I'll turn the camera right back on. Alright guys, I got the stand wheel off. And I need to find a nut that would fit that. And then take that off and I can take off the whole fucking hub. Okay. Let's get... What are you looking at? Okay, well, what side nut is that? Oh, garage is dirty. I know, I know, I know. Let's see, where is my tools? Mm. No, mm, yeah, I need an extension. All right, let's get going. <clears throat> okay, what size is this? Oh, sucks doing it one hand. Sorry guys if the camera's shaking. I'm trying to do everything with one hand. I'm a fucking my mask. And yes, this is this is a drift car. There's nothing in this car. None of this shit work. I'm not pretty sure that's. None of that work. The keys don't work. Everything's on a panel. Race car. And that's a 19. Cool. Maybe I need an extension. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I guess the. The guy never actually tying it down. What a fucking asshole. Okay. Okay, how the fuck? Maybe these bolts? Nah. I'll take them out though. Way too fucking big. What the fuck was I thinking? There you go. I wonder what was holding the steel on. Is it these little bolts? Because the show wasn't that big ass boat. We will see. Oh, maybe it was. <laughs> yeah, 
you know, I always watch people do installs on YouTube. And I give them props. Doing this shit with one hand can be really challenging. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're just holding on by those three little bolts. Shame on the guy who did this car. eBay, eBay, eBay. Goodbye. I guess I can go ahead and take this shit off too since I don't need it no more. Huh? Since none of it works. Oh man, I might as well. well. I won't do it later, I know it. Might as well do it now. Oh, my car's leaking something. Mm, screwdriver. Sorry about the, the wind noise. It's Christmas and it's hot as shit down here. <clears throat> and I'm taking it off because it don't work. I guess I have a whole bunch of spare parts for my coupe over there. Why does everything keep fucking falling down? Put that back where it was so I won't lose it. Okay. Let's get this other side out. More spare parts. And I'm guessing this bolt back here does something. I'll take it off and see. I wish I could see what the fuck I'm filming. Probably filming nothing. I need a better camera than this damn GoPro. Uh, uh oh. Oh, that takes that off. I need to take this off. Why oh, are you being so hard? Slide out. Maybe I need to pry it. Oh, yeah, I do need to pry it. <laughs> I'm gonna take that off. Oh, look at that bearing. Come on, man. But broke it, or I just got it out. I guess fuck it. I don't need it. There's a lot of people coming through this damn neighborhood. I don't need a star bit for that one. Okay guys, so let's get straight to putting the steering wheel on. Ok, 
Okay. I start off by taking all these little bolts off that held uh, the horn button in, which I don't need. I wish I could have kept that. Can I? Nah, I'm not gonna fuck it. But anyway, they sent me, I guess it's the quick release part. Okay. That goes like this. Just go in this end and get the nut and put it in. I'll be right back. Alright, I got it installed. They gave that's an anakin with it, cool. But, uh, I got it dirty. Maybe I shouldn't have got white for a drift car, huh? Anyways, that looks amazing. Mmm, time to put the quick release on and see how it goes on so I can put it onto the hub. like that I guess the NRG sticks off oh shit the NRG logos go up so that needs to be like like that okay alright guys putting the hub in now I guess I should go ahead and put this bolt back in. Huh. What the fuck is this screw for? I guess nothing. Oh, it's all cricket. What the fuck? Straight. NRG straight. Alright. Maybe I should get my impact for this. No, it's too far away. Oh, turning the wheel. Okay. Okay, that's tight. That's tight enough. Okay. Uh oh, what's all this extra bolts for? Oh, 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 okay. Well, let's put the hub in. I'm guessing these bolts go to that, yeah? Maybe? Okay, I'll be back. Alright guys, I got the, the quick release on the hub. I guess you're just going to have to match the letters with the letters. This is really easy actually. You just put the bolt in and tie in it now. Alright guys, I'm going to tie in all this. I'm going to get back to you. Alright guys, staying where it's done, I had to switch all those little bolts off because I had the wrong one in. I had this one out. I had this one in, it was in for that one. But I have the horn delete in, so I had to use smaller bolts. And it's all done. Look at that, look at that. Uh oh, missed it. Look at that. Wow. Honestly, this look amazing. The reason I went with white and gold is because the car will be painted white soon. And I like gold. Yeah. Once again, I want to thank thanks DD Performance and Interior for hooking me up with this real nice setup right here. Y'all go check them out. Link will be down in the description. Peace.